welcome back to my channel and today I'm gonna show you my motorcycle which is this one and the main thing I'm here is to show you and to talk to you about this helmet from GV which basically it's the HPS 50.6 uh, full face helmet that I've been riding for the last uh, week uh, there are some things I like on the helmet there are some things I don't like and I'm gonna give you my opinion about it having said that let me just uh, go here uh, to show you the the helmet as you can see full face helmet thermoplastic material with which weights around 1490 kilograms so it's uh, around the average weight for this kind of helmet uh, it has a good uh, aerodynamic shape I like it it uh, it is very uh, easy to, to fit uh, on your head uh, what I'm gonna tell you now that uh, I have an issue with this helmet well it's not a helmet it's uh, a helmet and my head it's not the perfect shape for my head uh, this is helmet lent for review so uh, I do not I didn't choose it they sent me uh, I will review it but uh, some of the points I'm gonna mention it's because it's not a helmet that I I choose on purpose I went to the store and I, I tried it and it fits me and everything so take, take that in consideration because that is a very important point uh, in a, when I talk about the, especially the interior okay uh, what I can say about this helmet you have ventilation here on the front you have also ventilation on the top and you have exit on the back uh, as you can see I'm a very bold guy well not very but I have a little bit bold and uh, I can tell you that the ventilation is good on this helmet uh, it gives you a nice breeze while you are riding and I'm very pleased uh, on the way uh, and I feel also we have a nice field of view with the visor so you have you have good vision for uh, both sides which is nice and you have a security system which is when you put it down you have to give it a little bit to hear this click and now it is very secure it won't move you have an interior sun visor which you use this uh, latch here to pull it down like this quite useful when you are riding you don't need sunglasses but I do have a problem with these two together why because when I close this visor and I need to open it uh, a little bit the gap here it's two fingers for me it's a very big gap and this part of the visor will stays on my uh, field of view and when this sun visor is down you, ha you have a little bit uh, I know it's an edge on the end of the sun visor and uh, also interferes with my field of view especially when I want to look at the mirrors so when you have this in this position you it's impossible to ride uh, I really don't like it and why I have to have this in this position basically in the winter because this helmet uh, doesn't not does not come with pin lock it's pin lock ready but the pin lock it's it's uh, sold separately so you have to buy it uh, uh, separately and if you don't have the pin lock in the in the winter you're gonna need to open it and you have a really really big gap where uh, the rain uh, will hit you uh, more often than you wish okay this is one of the issues I have with the helmet besides that everything uh, is fine in the interior okay micrometric latch so the standard nowadays on every helmet you just uh, so okay very easy to open and to and close uh, the rings you only have when you are when you have racing helmets then this is a everyday uh, helmet it's not to go for the racing track for the racing track you have other kinds of helmets more lightweighted better incinerization and more aerodynamic this is for you to ride every day so the micrometric system which I'm which I've showed you here it's more than enough of course you have the removal and anti-allergic interior so you can remove everything wash it and put it uh, back again and uh, you have also this wind protector here and this nose guard which are removable but another thing I don't like in this helmet is that let me close this it's the wind protector here because it comes out very easily just now when I was parking the bike I was I removed the helmet 
and it just fall down. So this is the something that uh, you have to be careful every time you put on the helmet and you take it off because uh, it's very uh, easy to come out uh, as it is very easy to install. But it shouldn't be like this. Uh, it's something that uh, I already had an issue with another helmet I have. I have another GV, uh, modular helmet, and I already lost this, this part, this wind protection. And now, uh, usually it's a helmet that I have there stopped because I don't like riding it without this wind protection. And without this, it's not good for me, especially since I do motovlogging and I need the most uh, uh, quiet inside. Talking about quiet inside, the, the sound inside, it's quite good. Uh, you can do a nice ride with it. Uh, it's not uh, uh, the most quiet uh, helmet in the world, but uh, it's uh, doable, it's rideable. Uh, it's nothing uh, that uh, you say, ah, I'm going to put it away, it doesn't work. It's a, it's a really nice helmet. Beside this couple things that I've been talking about, um, just get, taking a look at the helmet to see what I can tell you. Okay, the, the visor. Uh, it's a spring-loaded mechanism, so it's quite easy. You just uh, pull this uh, latch up and down, release the visor, uh, very easy. It takes like 20 seconds to, to, remove, to remove and install a new visor. Uh, once you get used to it, of course, so it's a nice mechanism. And basically, this is it, what I have to tell you uh, about this helmet. Uh, I'm quite happy with it. Uh, unfortunately, it's not the perfect size for my head. Uh, I wish it was, because it's a nice helmet. And uh, one thing I have to tell you also, that I almost, almost forgot, is that you have this helmet like in uh, 14 design graphics. Three of them are uh, designed for uh, the women and you have co solid colors also. Personally, I like this one. It matches my motorcycle, you see? Black, white, and, and, uh, and red. So it's a nice uh, conjugation. Uh, I like the helmet. I would have to buy a, a pin lock. Uh, I'll probably, if I stay with this helmet, I will give it to my wife. She will, she will ride it, she will wear it. And for her, it will be a really nice helmet. Having said this, guys, I think I'm going to put the helmet back here, make sure it doesn't fall, it's protected. And uh, I really hope that you like this review of this GV helmet, uh, full face, which uh, I brought to you. I'm going to step back and forth so you can see my motorcycle also. And please, don't forget, subscribe to the channel, follow my other networks, and I really hope to see you in the next one. Bye!